Hi. Hello. Hello, governor. Hey, everyone. Aren't you excited? Oh my god, I'm like on the camera for like the first time in like ages. Can you send us my happiness exuberating from my paws? My hair looks like a bird's nest and I have a spot on my chin somewhere which makes me look really unattractive and like it's really dark outside and blah 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 but I am back on the camera so I am totally happy ready for another random video. So yeah this is just gonna be a random update video with loads of random things put in it just to show you that I'm still alive. Yeah! So what should this video be about? It's not like I have a have a uh, topic board or anything. Now you know that every YouTuber has like a series of question and answer videos. I Justine, Brittany Louise Taylor, Winter Spring Pro, they all do it. And yeah, you guessed it. I'm gonna have one too. And I'm like, like, excited. And I'm actually quite surprised because when I tell all my friends about it, they're like, yeah, we wanna be in it. We wanna be in it. And all of them don't really want to be in videos usually. So this is gonna be a way for you to see all my totally sex delicious friends. So yeah, I'm talking to you, Georgia, and I'm talking to you, Sarah, and, and and Grace, and all you other people you're gonna be in my question and answer videos. So I'm looking at you watching my video. I'm talking to you, totally attractive person looking at my video. Pause the video right now with my finger pointing at the camera and go into the comments and ask me a question. Come on, pause it. Pause it with my finger pointing at you. Have you done it yet? Have you, have you commented yet? Yeah, you have? Uh, good, I can put down my arm. Oh, I've been doing that for like half an hour. The only problem is, is I don't have a clue what to call this series of videos. I mean, I could call it Ask Rob or The Word of Rob or something, but then I'd just be copying other YouTubers and it wouldn't be unique to me. One of my friends did give the idea of calling it Rob's Ribbit, which I did think was really cool, but if you have a better suggestion, just put it in the comments as well. And. My, the one that I think is my favourite, I will choose. Secondly, let me tell you how frustratingly hard maths is in the UK. In most subjects, I'm very able, and as long as you put the time in and the effort, they're quite easy in one retrospect, with my favourite definitely being science. Toby sees an article in a newspaper. Heart disease is one of the most common deaths in the UK, and they concluded that watching TV increases the risk of dying from heart disease. Look at the graph. See that? See, see that? See that going up like that? Yeah. Discuss whether Toby's graph correctly represents the correlation described in the article. Well, well, we have point here, and it goes up, and it, it goes up, and it, it goes up. Well, it goes up, so it's right. Deal with it. Well, the point I'm trying to get across is that if you know the textbook and you have common sense, then none of these exams are really hard. Apart from maths. Luckily, I finished my calculator and non-calculator exams around two weeks ago, and even though I'm really confident that I'm going to get the B that I think I deserve, there are still some things in there that I never knew and never will know, which are totally pointless, which I'm never going to need to know in real life. Here's an example. Oh no, all my practice exams are on the bottom of the of the thing you're standing on, camera. How am I gonna do this now? Um, oh, lucky I have my mathematics workbook. Multiply out the brackets and simplify where possible. Four, bracket, x plus y, bracket, minus three, bracket, y plus x, bracket, bracket. If anyone can do that question, then you are freaking Albert Einstein, because I cannot do that. To be fair, I would have given you a harder question, but all of my exams are in the bottom of the tray that you're standing on, and I'm not getting it out just, just for that, because then you wouldn't be able to see my face anymore. And you want to see my face better than grades, don't you? Don't you? Yeah, yeah, you do. Or maybe everyone does know that answer, and maybe I'm just stupid. I'm gonna be a janitor forever! <laughs> oh well, I guess that the little 15 year old janitor's right. Right? <laughs> One more time for good measure. <laughs> Very topic! Now, as I'm officially the most mature person in the whole of the world, Why can't my parents or someone else love me this much? Oh, I love you all the way up to my toes, he said. <laughs> Why doesn't anyone love me up to my toes? Example two. We are soulmates, I say. Soulmates! Go, Bakugan! Oh. Go, Bakugan! Oh. 
Go back, you go. Go back. Oh, yeah. Oh my God. Go back, you gone. I am the best back, you gone in the world. Look, all right, we get it. I'm the most mature person in the world. Deal with it, Jesus, girl. Well, I was looking through my subscription box and found out that Minnie Mouse has a new show. This guy is going to be pretty excited. I'm telling you. Yeah, that's right. I didn't go to film my reaction or anything. Okay guys, so due to copyright and everything else, I can't show you the film or sound of anything, well, most things, but what I can do, which I, uh, which I got the inspiration from my talk to snakes, is that you can put your headphones in, and then you can show your action, and then you won't get filed for copyright, because you're not showing anything. So the only thing you need to do is click on this link right here to watch the video before I do because all the things that I say won't make any sense unless you've seen it. And this is just for you, Emma, so this is going to be totally awesome. Let's go. Welcome to my new boutique where each and every bow's unique. If fun and fashion on what you seek, come inside and take a peek. If fun and fashion on what you seek, you're always welcome at Minnie's Boutique. Yeah, oh. Oh my god, Minnie, you're so amazing. Oh, Daisy, why can't you make any bows, darn you? I don't know why rubber's so rubbery, Daisy. Why are you asking me? In your wrist, make a bow with a great big twist. Why does a bird have a loofah? Why is Minnie wearing such high heels? To be fair, she is rocking them, but that's not the point. Oh god, the water's going everywhere. Someone do something. Find a first elephant. Oh my god, that's genius. Why would you grab the ribbons, Minnie? <gasps> oh, Minnie, you're so smart. What would I do without you as a friend? Come on, Daisy, you can do this. Come on, Daisy. Bow with a, a big twist. Yes, yeah, she did it. Oh my god. Oh my god, she did it. Oh, that's great. <laughs> they do look fabulous, Minnie. Yes, they do. Oh, there's no business like rubber bow business. Oh my gosh. <gasps> oh, that's the best show I've seen in a long time. Oh. Don't you think that was good? It was so good.